<laughs> All right, we got my man Kyle Pecco here for the Dark Side of Beast Rider and the Sporting Tribune. Kyle, thank you for joining us on this fast Friday. Yes, sir. I just want to talk to you about you know being active over the course of the last few weeks and what that transition has been now that you've been acclimated to the active roster and going into the game on Sundays. What has that progress been like? Uh, I mean, not much of a transition. I mean, every week getting ready to play whether I was or not. So um, I think the coaches do a good job of getting us ready throughout the week. Like I said, whether you're playing or not, so that's off to them for, for the preparation. And then also leading up to every week, you know, different schemes call for different rules of engagement and such and forth. But from your personal standpoint and what you bring to the table, you know, we talked about your get off earlier on. We talked about, you know, being strong at the point of attack. Uh, what do you see going against this Patriot team that really you think you can help in that step in the run? I think uh, pad level is going to be key this week for us. Um, got some good guys on that side of the, of the line. So, uh, yeah, I think pad level, um, that initial shock with the inside hand is going to be key for us. You think you have that initial shock? I <laughs> am biased, so yes. <laughs> it, was a, it was a trick question because I, I know you have that. <laughs> Thanks, man. So let's go ahead and talk about that. You know, the initial shock, I think that goes to having violent hands. Yeah. And trusting your eyes and knowing where to have that good hand placement. Yeah. So talking about leverage, talking about hand placement, uh, this is all fundamentals, but something that comes second nature to you, who would you credit that to? Uh, so I think all D-line coaches mm. that I've had uh, always just, is violence. So inside, and in the trenches, interior three at least, is always that initial shock and, and being violent with the hand. So I credit all my D-line coaches, man. I've learned something from each and every one of them, whether it was from high school to college, to even to the league now, obviously. So uh, try to take in all that I could learn, all the knowledge I could get. Um, and I think a lot of that is just being violent, being low, um, shock and shake. Shock and shake, I like it. Yeah. All right, well, that's Kyle Pickle, guys. Thank you so much, man. Yep. Appreciate it.